Oh, that was a face mask and another condom. Mount up. Good thing you're not claustrophobic. Wait, it's the Squip hole up. Place is just filled with critters. Blasting him. It's oh, man. Hey, wifey. Let's go. Oh! What are you doing, man? Kicking my ass here, man. Oh, shit. Brown. How are you doing? This game is wicked. Hey, yeah, I'm good. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I'm good. I guess I'm kind of misread what you wrote. Time to do it on your own. Someone locked it solid. It didn't. Look, there's a hole in it. Need a key. If my key is exploding it, I'm gonna do that. She open. This mecton is new. You all alone. No one looks. in here. Uh, I have no idea. No idea, wifey. Probably. No more said he was lurking, but who knows? Did I turn then? That was weird. Wait, those are turrets? Somebody living down here. Except for these guys. Get in there, man. Oh shit, son. that or a dog whatever it is. does not want to die I'm gonna die <laughs> hey, boy. Stuck. is that what it is This would make anyone woozy. Almost too easy. Yeah, almost. Leave 
leave that scrap behind. What is that? The shit? It was close as well because there's oil there. And you can't jump out of oil. A beanie? Condom? Better hold on to that. Upsy daisy. Oh, let's not do that. Ready to yeah. ride. Good. Let's go. What's out here then? Technically, our objective is over there, but hey. There is a dodge. You can actually dodge. What are these like? Are these remnants of the old? Seven C should have been stated right there in Oxenol. Nothing's more important right now than this. Okay. Well, no, no, the condom. We have a very good resistance. Oh, no, this has a very good resistance to the, uh, is it the blue one? Whatever that one is. This is a medical base. There's somebody in here. What it sounds like there is. No, this is not the same place. Hey, uh, check that out. Area completed. Oh, nice. Oh, I didn't see what that was. Better than nothing. Indeed it is. In fuck indeed, man. Is the bubble all right, wifey? Is bubble okay? Is he uh? He stopped being so upset. It's a lack of air. Oh, now I understand. Okay. Now I understand.
Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, crap. There we go. That over there is Steepo Depot, the cliffside that Moog hangs on to. What's up, Moog? Hey, Moog is big. Moog is really big. Yeah, Pisonic Mark's territory. Let's see. I can't believe he does that. Oh. Probably good, dude. Go for that. Guy's big, man. Why is he so big? What's I do not This one's like impressed goes... to see you out here. He figured you'd be dead by now. Not many are as tough and clever as you must be. Well, Claims he goes after the most dangerous game. Huge monsters. Mook says that all your power doesn't do you a bit of good if you're not willing to pull the trigger when the time comes. Indeed. Choosing what to kill and what to spare are the most important decisions you'll make. You might have a steady aim, but you need to be sure that you pick your targets with care. It's hard to make those life or death decisions for others, but someone's got to do it. Otherwise, they'll do it themselves and you know they'll miss. When it comes to monsters, he mostly picks who dies. Says it's wild that the world seems to be coming back, but he supposes that means more monsters for him to shoot. Wonders why you work so hard to keep things alive. Bullets help thin the herd instead. Says you should give up on working with the stubborn myriad. He keeps trying to put out their lights and they keep putting up new ones. Over boo -boo. Ah. Says they keep the monsters away. He needs them closer, not farther. Dear. Oh. But enough of that, right? He says the wildlife, nature, has changed and turned against us. Instincts of survival took over when the world changed. He's not sure about their veggie diet anymore, and if it's changed, who knows what it's done with the chemical composition of their body output. Right now, though, he feels he's come to a point where he's got a pretty clear idea on the whereabouts of monsters, both tall and short. Says as big as they are, the world is bigger. To find where they are, you need to see where they've been. Moog says you must learn to walk before you can run. It takes practice before you can call yourself a monster hunter. Fortunately for you, he can help. He understands you need to start off with something small before you go big. Wow. There's no better place to start than a squip cave. Hunting down a couple of these little critters for yourself should keep you on your toes. <laughs> You need to start off small before you go big. Yes, this is true. This is this is true. Because once you go big, you never go back. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, I'd rather shoot when I'm ready to hunt. Thinks you have bigger issues than your so-called haunting skills if you're going to nitpick on his grammar. I think it's dark, somewhat light. Mm -hmm. Interesting. 
Whoa, there's some hefty tech going on in there. Can I have it? Moog says you should go hunt for squips in the cave he gave you directions to. Well, I've probably already done that. Probably already done it. Are your yeah. lungs aching? I have already done it. Once the volatilization from the nuclear waste evaporated, a volatile gas rose through the soil and infested structures, even Toxanol's own buildings. So, in a way, they caused their own death. Yeah, indeed. Sinking. I don't know what that is. Is that just rust? Oh, idea. Go knock the lid off that sludge truck. It'll fill the place up and you can get up to that entrance there. I don't know if I missed anything, but I'm oil. Well. There's not yeah. much left of what we used to call our world. Sorry, what? The one we were in earlier. I don't know. Squips caught. Oh, the squips. That's what the guy wanted. You need to line up the switches so they match. Just a few moves left. Make them count. Good. That's enough electric current to initiate the actuators and activate the framework. and keep the creature. Can't see it. I 
gonna vacuum head with a paddle. Blue blade. Blue blade. The world is waking up with dawn. Moog asks if you know the first rule of monster haunting. It's to go where the monsters are. To haunt, you must know the grounds of your prey. Few monsters warrant the fear we have for them. And you don't look like someone that's easily scared. You could help him out. Start with one monster and take it from there. Spot its tracks and report back. Also, bring back any poo you find. His friend Boom has a nose and a use for that. Really? Kumo uno shala. Says you're right. You gotta catch them all. Light instantly banishes dark. How much light do you really need? All the light, all of it. Oh, I mean, you could leave a little space for the dark. Gotta catch them all, lol. This way. You look like you've been doing this your whole life. I have. Get this up. Get this up, this river of oil. That doesn't look good down there. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna head down there. There's a place and time for everything, but for that sick scenario, it's already come and gone. Oh. Daytime means the clock to nighttime is ticking. Uh, 
Yeah. Usually how it works, yeah. I'm getting weird with the bot. Screw this. Wait, did I get it? I got it. No way. Got it with the bot. Shelter 7B is still there, open and ready to shelter. difficult to see I guess that's kind of the point keep on tracking down here and things will look up eventually time to walk on your own legs Fancy. Another condom. We haven't crafted anything since since we learned, actually. We haven't changed our gear since the start of the game either. We could probably do that. Yeah. 